If you are looking for a dog that is majestic, loyal, and gentle, you might want to consider the Great Dane. This breed, also known as the German Mastiff or the Apollo of dogs, is one of the largest and most elegant dogs in the world. Great Danes are not only impressive in size, but also in personality. They are friendly, dependable, and courageous, making them excellent companions for families and individuals alike. In this video, we will explore the history, characteristics, and care of the Great Dane, and why this breed might be the perfect match for you. They are now well known for being loving and laid-back family companions for the appropriate family. We discuss the advantages and disadvantages of owning a Great Dane in the video. So watch it to the end if you're curious about what it's like to have one of these dogs in your home. Strong and massive, Great Danes can appear intimidating to those who are unfamiliar with them. They are among the most placid dogs you will ever meet, despite the fact that their size alone deters potential burglars from trying to break into their owner's house. The name, Gentle Giants, comes from the fact that these dogs are typically cautious and understanding around kids. We will learn more about them later on. If you're ready, let's get started with today's video, where we'll discuss both the advantages and disadvantages of owning a Great Dane. Pro. Number 1. Great Danes are friendly and loving with their owners. To start out the benefits of this breed, let me tell you how loving they can be. Despite their intimidating appearance, Great Danes are actually amiable and affectionate dogs that adore their families. Despite their enormous size, they would actually adore cuddling with their owners. They are also calm dogs that love nothing more than to play with the family's younger members. Yes, if you're looking for a dog that will give you companionship, you'll love having them in your home. Excellent guard dogs are Great Danes. The Great Danes' size and bark alone deter burglars from entering your property. But if they persist past the point of recognition that is, upon seeing your enormous dog, they are bound for serious trouble as long as they receive the proper training. Great Danes were originally used to hunt wild boar, so it is expected that they are guard dogs by nature. However, they require an experienced owner who can provide them the right training and early socialization to make them wary of strangers. But still loving toward their humans. Great Danes will be able to protect you and your property from danger. Number 2. Great Danes get along well with household pets. If socialized from an early age, Great Danes can coexist peacefully in the home with other animals. But because they grow so large, this dog's size may intimidate cats and other smaller pets. Introduce your Great Dane to a variety of people's sights, sounds, environments, and animals when they are still young to help them develop into well-mannered dogs who can handle new situations with grace. Number 3. Grooming a Great Dane is simple. Their hair is short, silky, and smooth, requiring little maintenance. To keep their hair in the best condition, they should brush it once a week at least with a soft bristle brush. It will also aid in dispersing skin oils uniformly. Give them a bath only when absolutely necessary, like after they get really filthy. This breed also requires frequent toothbrushing, trimming of their nails when they grow too long, and examination of their eyes and ears for soreness, redness, or any indications of infection. Number 4. Great Danes are excellent athletes. They require consistent exercise. Great Danes are wonderful companions if you're searching for a dog that will encourage you to exercise regularly. As a young puppy, make sure to consult your veterinarian or the breeder. When your Great Dane matures, you will need at least an hour of physical exercise, which can be in the form of playing in the yard or going for walks in the park. Without exercise, your Great Dane may develop destructive behaviors like destroying your furniture and barking excessively. Great Danes have different exercise needs than adult ones. Keep in mind that because these dogs grow so quickly, they may be prone to certain joint and bone problems. Number 5. Great Danes are gentle, intelligent, and laid-back, making them extremely trainable dogs. Great Danes are easy to train, but they are sensitive and pick up on their owner's emotions quickly. As a result, they will be able to tell when their owner is upset or angry, which may compromise the effectiveness of the training. Treat your dog when they do something you like, rather than punishing them severely, which should never be done to any breed of dog. Great Danes benefit greatly from positive reinforcement methods, so in addition to food rewards, you might also want to give them lots of playtime and praise. And this video is already halfway done. Do you currently believe that the Great Dane is the best breed of dog for you? We still have a few things to learn about these dogs, so without further ado, let's move on. Please share your thoughts with us later. Cons Number 1. The lifespan of a Great Dane is brief. 
Great Danes live shorter lives than other dog breeds. Which is perhaps one of the most significant drawbacks of this breed to be aware of. This is true of all giant-sized dog breeds. If they receive proper care, Great Danes can live for an average of 6 to 9 years. Even though it is hard to accept that your dog will only live a brief life. They will undoubtedly make every moment you spend with them special. Number 2. Like all dog breeds, Great Danes are prone to certain health problems. If you're thinking about getting a dog of this breed, keep an eye out for their propensity for certain health issues. Among them are joint problems, cancer, and bone problems. Allergies and cardiac conditions. Give your dog a healthy diet and exercise, take them to the vet once or twice a year, and most importantly, give them lots of love and attention to extend their life. Number 3. Great Danes drool a little bit. Before bringing one of these dogs home, you should also take into account the fact that they drool a little bit because of their square muzzle and loose lips. The saliva of Great Danes cannot be kept inside their mouths. While they may drool in several places around the house, their eating and drinking areas are the most likely places. Having said that, you may want to think about getting a different breed of dog if you're not a fan of drooling dogs. Number 4. Chewing is a passion for Great Danes who will chew on anything they can find lying around the house. It is crucial to keep your personal items out of their reach as a result. To stop your dog from chewing on your furniture and other household items, you should always keep them away from potentially fatal items like live wires and poisonous chemicals. Since their jaws and teeth are strong, they could easily destroy cheap chew toys, so invest in high-quality, long-lasting toys. Great Danes are gentle giants all around. Whether they're lounging on the couch or playing outside with their family, we're happiest when they get to spend time with them. These dogs aren't for everyone, but the right family will undoubtedly receive a lot of love and affection from them. Do you believe that a Great Dane is the best breed of dog for you?